Long, long ago, deep in the forest, there was a hidden village where tiny creatures lived. They called themselves Smurfs. They were good. Then there was Gargamel, the evil wizard. He was bad. Oh, I hate Smurfs. I'll get you. I'll get all of you if it's the last thing I ever do. <laughs> I'll get you! I'll find your village someday! You'll be sorry! Well, the forest is still there. And if you listen, you may hear Gargamel's rage. And if you are good, you may just catch a glimpse of the Smurfs. to see into the future, and she came highly recommended. Of course I want to see into the future, you fool. The age of wizardry is past. A new era is dawning, and if I can be the first to see it, I will become the most powerful wizard of my time. Wait, wait. please, Godfather. I, I know someone who can really help you see into the future. Do not try my patience, groveling godson. Who is this someone? Father Time. I can lead you to his cave. When the future beckons, there is no time for subtlety. Uh, but how about time for a rest? If he'd be just asking. You know what must be done, godson. You heard him, Asriel. Heave. Now. Why, you ruffians, how dare you break down my door. When I get my hands on you, Gargamel, you'll be history. Mm, yeah, yeah. You have to catch me first. <laughs> How did I do, Godfather? Excellent. Now bring me the sickle, Gargamel. Uh, right away. You have done well, Godson. Perhaps I was wrong about you. But I don't think so. Balthazar, release me at once and give me back my sickle. You might disturb the fabric of time. That's exactly what I intend to do. Now tell me, where is this fabric of time? It's all around us, you fool. And now you've torn a hole in it. Good. At last I can see what the future holds. Get away from me. Hey, if that's the future, I've seen enough. Once Gargamel may have the right idea, we're getting out of here. But don't you see what you've done? You've opened a hole into the distant past. I can't let my past mistakes interfere with my future plans for the time. Oh, no. Balin Sandpipers, I think you oversmurfed it a little, Slouchy. Uh-oh. I hope I didn't lose it. Nah, we'll find it. Come on. Looks like something found it first. Creep and crawfish. What do you call that? I don't know, but when he walks, he sounds like thunder. <laughs> Smurferoo, little thunder seems to like him, Sloggy. And I think he wants to play. <laughs> okay, fella. Fetch! supposed to rain today? Well, it obviously is going to rain, Smurfit. So I suggest getting the Smurf barrel covered, because there's nothing worse than soggy Smurf berries. <laughs> Unless it's taking orders from Brainy Smurf. Very funny. Hey, what was that? <gasps> and what is that? Yeah, it's a monster! Smurf for Donald! Smurfering all the way to the village, Slouchy. Smurfering here. I wonder what the other Smurfs will say when 
I see him. Oh, Baba Smurf! It was a big monster! A big, horrible monster! I wish I could have seen this creature. Isn't that a Smurferang? No, that's him! Run, my little Smurfs! for all this? Um, uh, well, sort of, Papa Smurf. It all happened like this. Well, he seems pretty friendly now. Don't touch him, Smurfette. You don't know where he's been or where he comes from. I think I do. Smurfa, look at this. Smurferoo. That looks like our new friend. Get bigger. They're called dinosaurs, Nat. And this one's just a baby. Then are we gonna take him home, Papa Smurf? That's just it, Slouchy. Dinosaurs haven't existed on Earth for 60 million years. Then what's Little Thunder doing here? I don't know. But something has disturbed the orderly progression of the centuries. Father Time should be told about this. I think so, I think you may be right, Nat. But Father Time will know how to get Little Thunder back home. Hiding hedgehogs, Pappy! Father Time's nowhere to be found! I'm afraid something terrible has happened to Father Time. Papa Smurf! Papa Smurf! Something terrible is happening to Little Thunder! Hmm. Loss of tail tension, flaking scales. Uh... He'll be all right, won't he, Pappy? Won't he? I'm afraid he may not, Sasset, if we can't get him back to his own time. We have to do something in the meantime, Papa Smurf. An herbal tonic may keep his strength up, but I'll need mugwort, fennel root, mint leaves, <laughs> Lucky Brady, I got plenty of mint leaves. <laughs> well, I had plenty of mint leaves. Golly, what's this? Oh, probably nothing of any importance, Clumsy. I'll just hang on to it. All we need now, Nat, are some mint leaves. Papa Smurf, Papa Smurf, look what I found. It's important, isn't it? Great Smurfs. This material is from Balthasar's cape. smurf a -roo. So he's the one responsible for Father Time's disappearing. Yes, we must get to Balthasar's castle and rescue Father Time. He's the only one who can help Little Thunder get back home. <laughs> or we burn Willows, he'll never make us. Maybe this will help. Say, ah. Uh... <laughs> Hungry and thirsty, Father Time? There's enough food and drink for two, if you show me how to see the future. Well, then, then how come there's not enough food for three? <laughs> Let's make a deal. I'll let you go and give you back your sickle, if you'll just tell me how to cut a little tiny hole into the future. Uh, you're not really going to let him go, are you? Of course not. No deal, Balthazar! Then hear me well, ancient one. I'm going to start slashing and hacking at your precious fabric of time until nothing is left but ribbons. The primitive past will pour into the present. Stop! Very well. You win, Balthazar. I knew you'd see things my way. Gargamel, bring my good friend for the time something to eat. And a little for ourselves, eh, Azriel? Yeah. Oh. Little Thunder is slowing down again, Papa Smurf. I think he needs some more tonic. There's only a little bit left, Papa Smurf. I'm afraid Little Thunder is too weak to go on. I'll stay here with him, Papa Smurf, but please hurry. We'll Smurf our best, Slouchy. Golly, Papa Smurf, how do we get in? Quietly, clumsy. Up the chain, my little Smurfs. And speed is of the essence because we don't want to wake up the Moat Monster! Like this? No, no, Balthazar, that's wrong. It's all in the wrist. More like this? For a powerful wizard, you're a very slow runner. I'm losing patience, old man. Show me how to cut into the future. How can I show you without moving my hands? Then I'll release you. Now, no more excuses. Well, is it future yet? Ah! What? Where, where? Startled, starling. It's happy going to kill. Smurfs, get to my real. Yeah. Yeah. Faster, my little 
Smurfs. Too late. Gotcha. Thanks to you, Godfather, there's Smurfs stew in our future. Smurfs stew? How revolting. Get them out of my sight immediately. Very well. That leaves more din din for us. Come, Mazriel. <laughs> now, Father Time, back to the future. I am so happy now, for, as you can see, I have the cage of Smurfs to fill my own tummy. <laughs> yeah, dum, 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 yum, 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 yum. That sounds like Gargamel. Just think, Azriel, Smurfs stew with enough for leftovers. Oh, no. Gargamel's got every Smurf. Am I going to save him, Little Thunder? You stay here. Hey! Let me go, you big smurf yapper! <laughs> That's the last time you try scampering up my shin, you little blue bug! Ah, it's the beast again! Whoa! I'm sickle away from Bulbasaur before it's too late. First a uh, twist to the left, then a uh, half a uh, twist to the right. At last, the future is mine! Ow! Gotcha! In the nick of time! Thank you, my little blue friends! Please, Father Time, help Little Thunder! Oh, he's gonna die! <laughs> I hope there's enough time! Stand back! We'll help you through. Smurf and Moo, but you look at that volcano. Hugging hedgehogs, look at Little Thunder's mother. All I can see is Little Thunder waving goodbye. But I'm glad he's safe and sound. Hey, what about me? I demand you fools release me. Just sit tight, Balthazar. <laughs> Father Time is right. If you wait long enough, the future is bound to come to you. <laughs>